Today, I'm back on my max level account to try out what might very well be the most brain dead way you can kill someone in a single attack. Now, the first thing we're gonna do to make sure we deal as much damage as humanly possible is uh, make sure that we're actually max level. Currently, I'm like a couple levels off. So uh, yeah, you know what? Let's just grab a random fruit and we're gonna get to max level with it. So it's gonna be the smoke fruit. All right. All right, let's make our way to the final island in the game and actually eat the fruit. You know, we, we can't be using any kind of fruit. Now, let's just do this man now at least the smoke fruit is actually pretty freaking good so yeah and actually we also have an infinite damage move so yeah i can't complain come on baby oh uh, dude i just love doing this <laughs> you know what this actually feels kind of broken dude you're just literally aim at the ceiling and you're dealing like infinite damage <laughs> Yep, that works pretty good. All right, level 35. Okay, 2,435. You know what? I was thinking I was going to get all the way to max level, but then I realized I actually already have max stat points. I realized that I already had max stat points in blocks fruit. So technically, I'm already going to deal the max damage. And any extra levels are only going to help my melee, which I don't really need. So you know what? I think it's safe to say that we're ready to go. Now, you might be thinking to yourself, Jesse, how are you going to deal that much damage to pretty much kill people in a single hit? Now, let me show you exactly exactly how so first things first we're actually gonna need a very specific fruit okay and i'm pretty sure please uh you know tell me i'm not wrong here it's the fruit that has a single attack with the highest damage possible in the entire game now you know you might be thinking oh my god it's gotta be i don't know the dough fruit or like dragon fruit or something like that but actually the bomb fruit so let me eat this puppy nom, 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 nom. very tasty yeah guys the bomb fruit has some absolutely bonkers like single attack crazy high damage moves Boing. so like right now currently i pretty much have no like kind of damage boost going on actually i'll take even my like scarf off all right boom take that off so yeah right now i should have no crazy kind of damage boost i don't even have hockey enabled let me show you some of this stuff so all right targeted bomb fully max charge on the target bang 4500 okay actually it's not that crazy okay that's not the one we're after bomb crap okay 2700 it's pathetic that's not even what we're looking at what attack that actually does do a crazy amount of damage though is actually the landmines attack because what you can actually do is stack these on top of each other. So pretty much right now, if I let know, like I had some sort of item that would let me, you know, do multiple attacks really, really fast. I'm pretty sure this helmet does that. I can pretty much place a ton of landmines like this. And then only a few seconds later, I think it's like five seconds later, I can place a ton of them again. And I keep doing that until I've pretty much just created an area of like instant death. I just short pressed it. <laughs> Now, I think you can actually stack up to three of these attacks at the same time. And they'll just kind of like linger around like this. It's pretty nuts. Look at this. And yeah, guys, each one of these little bombs right here will actually explode on impact. So if I have this guy walking through it, as you guys can see, they all do like a thousand damage each. And this single attack has just done already over a thousand damage. Oh my God, it's already over 20,000 damage. Yeah, it can get pretty crazy. And not only just that, guys, one thing that we could actually do is stack a bunch of landmines and then just simply wait it out with the self-destruct ability. Now, this is actually kind of insane because when you get this fully charged up, there's no more sound. Like, usually it's really, really loud. Max charge, no more sound. Now, bang! 9,500 damage, which is bonkers. And that is without a single damage boost, not even hockey enabled. So, yeah, I think it's safe to say that we could make this pretty darn powerful. Now, actually, I think that the dark coat is the most powerful item for fruits, but I'll have to check this real quick. All right, Mr. Nerd, hello. All right, 15% extra damage on blocks fruits. Okay, what about the pill scarf? All right, so this one also does 15% more damage on fruit and sword attacks. Okay, this one's way better. <laughs> So yeah, let's see with that boost alone, how much extra damage we're doing. All right, here we go. Oh wait, what? He attacked me. Okay, crap. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's try it out. Also, by the way, this is once again without any extra help from like hockey and stuff. So, shkabang! We're already over 10,000 damage. That's insane. <laughs> All right, hockey enabled. Let's see. What other damage boosts can we actually do? Oh my God. We just got into a PvP. We got into a PvP. Ah! Oh my god, dude. I hit him with the landmines, dude. He was actually chasing me down. <laughs> oh my god, I got him. Wait, he's right here. He's literally right here. Wait, where'd he go? Oh my god, dude. This is so hard to see. Bang! Bro, get messed up. Don't mess with me, dude. Don't mess with me, dude. You don't know who you're messing with. Where'd he go? I actually lost him. Am I blind? Is that him up there? I think that's him right there. I think he just ran away. <laughs> 
Oh my god, dude. The bomb fruit does crazy amounts of damage. I almost killed him in a single attack, just waiting for him on the other side of the portal just then. All right, now, actually, I think one of the things that we could do to raise our attack damage is actually change races, because uh, as far as I know, this race here doesn't really give me any kind of, like, advantages, like, PvP-wise. All right, cyborg time it is. Give me the cyborg. Thank you very much, sir. Shkabang! All right, we now have the energy core, and I'm pretty sure that's gonna deal quite a bit of extra damage. Yes, nice. Now, it's quite visual, though, so we're gonna have to activate it after we activate the other attack. All right, we're back in the third seat, and now it's time for us to just find the perfect spot where we can actually sneak up on people so that they don't realize that we're actually there, and, uh, yeah, that we can pretty much get the jump on people and just deal tons and tons of damage. All right, now, actually, the very first spot that kind of comes to mind is right here on the castle. So, this right here is an area where, generally speaking, a lot of people PvP. So, yeah, if we can find kind of like a spot where people don't really expect it, or we can just deal a ton of damage. Now, one of those spots is actually, for example, like right here, because if we're on the inside of this castle right here, if we charge this all the way up, we just need someone to be kind of close to us. Let go! And we're gonna deal tons of damage. Bang! There you go. Boom. 6,000 damage. He did never, he never even saw it coming. He's panicking already. Look at that! Oh, wait, what? I'm caught in something. Uh-oh. I don't want to be caught in something. Oh, my God. I didn't even have my hockey enabled. Oh, my God, dude. I'm being comboed. I'm being comboed by, like, four guys! Dude, you gotta be kidding me! Okay, wait. You know what? I'm gonna steal. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna bait them out. They're coming. Oh, my God. They're, they might be coming. Come on. Come on. Come on. Dude, if they come through this portal, they are literally dead. Oh, I think they might be lucky. All right. I think they're lucky, and they actually uh, didn't come through the portal. <laughs> oh, wait. This guy wants to give me something? What is he trying to give me? I will give my best. Spirit Venom? Oh, my God. You know what? I'm on my perm fruit dealer account. I can get perm flame. <laughs> That's like the best I have. <laughs> No. I give bad fruit? What? Like bad? All right. Well, this is a very surreal trade. Uh, thank you very much, sir. Uh, enjoy your perm chop fruit. <laughs> All right. Well, the next spot I was actually going to talk about is somewhere kind of like right here where you can kind of just hide right behind the... Actually, I wish I was a little bit more in that corner right there. You can kind of hide right here in this corner. And as people are walking out, just, you know, turning on their observation hockey, not really realizing what's going on, you can absolutely send them, you know, I don't know, to the stratosphere. Oh my God, dude. He didn't have PvP on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bro, the moment I don't have my self-destruct, I got a little bit scared. All right, okay, we're doing it again, we're doing it again, we're doing it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This guy came for me! Ah! Oh my god, okay, we dealt a good amount of damage, but dude, this guy wants me bad. Oh, bro, he's like half health though. Bro, oh my god, he's getting me good though! Come on, man, come on! Explosive jump! Okay, dude, I, got, I gotta get the sneak up on him. You know, we can actually pretty consistently get this! If I can teleport next, uh, just, just, just get out of here. Just do anything to get out of here, thank you very much. Actually, right through the portal. <laughs> yes! Wait, what? Why did I teleport? Actually, you know what? I haven't even done the landmines yet. That's the one thing that like absolutely blows my mind, how it's not like a bigger part of like people just messing around in PvP, dude. I could literally stand right here, like, I don't know, so like right, right over here, literally in PvP safe zone, right on the edge of it, actually, and just spam a ton of landmines. And like other people, by the way, cannot see these. This is all invisible to them. Okay, they're coming, they're coming. Dude, the moment he runs out, the moment he runs out. Oh, wait, this is a friend of mine, this is a friend of mine. We're gonna just keep spamming this, we're gonna keep spamming. And actually, because I wanna up the damage for this one even more, I'm actually gonna put on the chopper hat. Oh, dude, there's a guy right here. Oh, dude, there's a guy right here. <laughs> oh my God, he's coming for me. Oh my God, he's coming for me. Wait, but am I gonna get him? Am I gonna, come on, come on, let's just teleport. Just pull over, pull over. Bro, what is this kind of combo? What is this, man? What is this? You know what? Just quickly get out of here. Get out of here. Ah, I messed up the teleport. I messed up the teleport. Oh, this is bad. Just get out of the PvP save zone and just get back to what we were doing. Yes. Nothing suspicious to see right here. Oh my god, this guy's coming for me. But he's inside of the PvP save zone. <laughs> oh, he's coming for me. Oh, he's coming for me. Wait, but he's about to get hit with everything he's ever seen in his life. Alright, come after me then, huh? Oh, wait, there's people, there's people, there's people. I'm bang! <laughs> Oh, dude, he never even saw it coming. Bang! Oh, dude, he's getting messed up right now. Oh, dude. Oh, wait. Ha, ha, ha. Yo, really? Yo, come on, man. Dude, I got 2v1. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guys, I think it's safe to say that the, the bomb fruit is pretty crazy for getting some weird combos. 